What's up everyone? Welcome to the channel. Today we have five blaster boxes of the exclusive Fanatics edition. So these came straight from Fanatics. They're priced about five dollars more. Um, and I think some of the bonus for the five bucks, the extra five bucks, is you get two extra packs. You get um, aqua base card parallels which are exclusive to the, the Fanatics boxes. And there's also a chance for very small chance for these Fanatics um, exclusive memorabilia redemptions, I think, which are like one in 200 boxes. So pretty low chance of hitting those. Um, I actually got uh, 10 of those, so I'll be ripping through those in a couple different parts. Um, anyway, thanks for joining. Without further ado, we'll get right into the rip. I have seen some of the uh, Aqua Parallels on eBay already, and uh, they are looking pretty nice. I, for one, like all the variety and the increased number of packs. I think they did much better this year with the print run being reduced uh, like by 300000 or something per base card per player um, from Series 1 to 2023. And without further ado, we'll get right into it. This first one feels a little thicker, so we'll see what we have. Got the good old start of the MLB right on the back. All right, let's get right into it. So I'm not going to spend too much time on the base. I'm sure most people have probably seen that. And that is the reason for the thicker pack there. Got Topps uh, Chrome, stars of MLB. There's the Lars Newt Bar. And our first Aqua is going to be Perlander Baroa and a Christian... Encarnacion Strand on the Stars of MLB. So nice, we hit a, uh, a Rookie on the Aqua and a Chrome Yordan. Very cool. Put that off to the side here. I gotta get my, my bearings. There we go. Alright, well, thank you for joining me on the channel. Um, would appreciate a like and subscribe. Keeps me going with the videos. And uh, leave a comment below. Let me know what you think of Series 1 so far. Excited to have some product to rip into. And here we go. That's Brandon Marsh. Got Dominic Canzone. And there's a Rosarina missing his helmet on the uh, 89 design. Very sharp looking. And Kenley Jansen on the Aqua Parallel. So I'll set those aside here. And on we go. So yeah, I bought, uh, let's see, one hobby version and one jumbo of uh, Series 1. It's a nice Corbin Carroll. Uh, but as I've seen and heard that uh, retail seems to be the way to go. So there's a Kirilov silver foil card, Yoshida on the Rookie Cup, and Edwin Diaz on the Aqua Parallel. Got a nice Shohei. I like the Stars of MLB design. I um, think it's better than past years. I know there were a uh, number of calls to just get it removed from the product. There's Jose Ramirez on the greatest hits. I do like these. Uh, these are pretty cool. Three home run game from Jose Ramirez on June 8th, 2023. Pretty sweet. Uh, there's Matt Walner. Big rookie from last year. There's a cool hit. Shohei Otani, Adolis Garcia, and Lou Bob uh, on the Aqua Parallel. I think that one's stand worthy. Exciting to see what excited to see what uh, Shohei does this next season. Being DH, have a uh, a year off from pitching. I think he's slated to get back into that 2025. Saw a video of him uh, learning Spanish, so that was pretty funny. All right, let's see. And here we go. There's the uh, Cubs on the Aqua Parallel. Not a Cub fan myself. And we'll just keep ripping right through. Hopefully we can hit one of the uh, top rookies on a Parallel. Stars of MLB, Marco Luciano. There's Sedane Raffaella. Good rookie right there. Correa Shower. 
So I do need to be on the lookout for SSPs. I'm pretty sure they would be uh, flipped backwards. There's Sal Frelick. Nice rookie right there on the 89 design. And Adbert Alzole. Man, that was a uh, tough one. I had to kind of pause there. I wanted to say Albert, but it's Adbert. Put him up here for now. Probably going to get booted off, but it's all right. All right. And it looks like we got Ellie right on the back there. Nope, not Ellie. Fernando Tatis Jr. Should have known by the jersey. All right. Josh Naylor. There's Marco Luciano. Good rookie. Uh, there's the Royal Blue Miguel Amaya. So it's pretty cool you still get, uh, and Seth Brown on the Aqua. It's pretty cool you still get the um, other retail exclusive parallels in there. Hoping for maybe one auto out of, uh, there's Curtis Mead, out of my purchase. There's Johnny Bench on the Grand Gamers. And Blue Jays Unite, Henry Davis. I've seen uh, too many of those Blue Jays Unite cards. I don't need any more of those. I think I have like a, a numbered version of it. Just in case I really like that picture, which I don't. All right, let's see one of those uh, Redemption cards in here. That'd be sweet. Jorge Polanco on the blue numbered to $9.99. So... Blue numbered is $9.99. Very cool. Bryce Harper on the Home Run Challenge. Nice to have uh, these to look forward to. Got a decent stack growing. Andres Jimenez on the Aqua. And that'll conclude it for the first box. We'll move right on to another box. Get that going. So yeah, I think... Uh, Pretty fun way to rip. You get two extra packs. Getting the uh, Aqua Parallels, which I think are cooler and they look nicer than... Uh, let me get this box back back in place. They look cool. They look better than the, uh, you know, like Easter bunnies and weird things like that. Nothing against Easter. I just... I don't know. I don't need... Easter and bunnies in the back of my baseball cards. It's kind of weird. Some people like the themed um, Halloween cards. I do not. I think it's weird. But, uh, yeah. I mean, if I pull one, they sell. So, I guess that's nice. It's Jaron Duran on the Royal Blue. And J-Rod on the Aqua. Nice color match there. Not the team color match, which is a different parallel. Pretty rare. Uh, and those look really nice put j-rod up there nice pc hit right there count how many times i say right there in this video okay now i'm going to try really hard not to say it henry davis not right there um let's see greg maddox mauricio duban and Henry Davis on the Stars of MLB. We're flying right through. If you've made it thus far, glad to have you still. Or maybe you're watching on two times speed, opening through, or uh, kind of ripping through. Here we go, Josh Young on Home Run Challenge. Brendan Donovan. I When I watch card opening videos, I, I put on two times speed, depending on how much I like the cab the uh, commentary, I will kind of skip through. Which I'm sure others do as well. Plenty of card opening content. There's Jordan Westberg on YouTube. Wonder what kind of uh, parallels variations they have for Grand Gamers. If there's some auto variations. There's Nick Robertson on the Aqua Parallel Rookie card. Very cool. And uh, onward and upward. I think I'll probably have to speed up some of this. 
This one feels a bit thicker. It's because we got Chrome, Stars of MLB, Tyler Soderstrom. Nice rookie to have there. And here we go. It's going to be home field advantage. Nice. I've seen these uh, cards. I haven't pulled one myself. And nice to get one myself finally. Jordan Alvarez. So liking the cool, the new design. Um, filling more of the space in the background. And uh, yeah, pretty awesome card there. Awesome. And we got a Chrome Adley. Dansby Swanson on the Aqua. Very nice. That was a big, uh, big pack. I was hoping to get a couple of those, maybe one or two. Nice to see, hopefully, another numbered card. So it does seem like you're getting <laughs> at least like one numbered card per blaster. Uh, and then, or maybe even more, and then you get all these parallels. I mean, yeah, I think uh, Blaster, definitely way to, the way to go, um, or retail in general, because I, I am going to get some uh, hangers coming in soon. Brandon Marsh, going to have to put together some sets. And this is flipped backwards. And, oh, because it's just the uh, silver foil. So I thought for a second, I'm like, is that an SSP? But... If it's a golden mirror, there's a cool one right there. Golden mirror, it will have uh, the whole back is yellow. So I think last year they had just the uh, little stripe showing that it was SSP. Um, and then of the uh, the logo will be gold as well, tops logo. And we'll get some right through these. There's Aaron Judge, 250th career home run. See what he can hit in his career. How many? And uh, here we go. Last pack of the second blaster. Got a nice Ellie right on the back. The uh, number one rookie to get. And Hayden Wesneski on the Aqua Parallel. Very cool. So the second box is pretty amazing. Got that J-Rod. Aqua got the home field advantage on the Ordon. Um, I would love to see, love to hit one of those uh, heavy lumbers. They also did a redesign on that this year. That would be pretty cool to hit. I hit one last year for uh, Ken Griffey Jr. actually, and that was pretty sweet. I like how they. Uh, they got the different texture to the cards. All right, Patrick Bailey, there's Dan Raffaella, Miguel Cabrera, 510th homer, 26th of all time. Pretty cool. And there's a nice PC hit, Nolan Arenado on the Aqua. The Aqua doesn't really fit. Uh, much for anyone else but uh, the Mariners, in my opinion. Looks like we got a gold coming up. And it's going to be Astros No No. Valdez throws the gem in Houston. Pretty cool to get a gold. Put that up there. I think I got one, one, or, one gold from my jumbo. And there's a big one. Look at that. Jason Dominguez on the team color match. That is an awesome hit. Of all the team color matches you can get, that's that's one of the top ones right there. Very awesome. That that card is probably going to be worth quite a bit, or at least it is right now, with all the hype surrounding Series One. Man, what a box! We still have uh, lots of packs left. Stars of MLB. J Rod. So we'll just kind of go relatively quick through these. Manny Machado on the 89 design. Merrill Kelly on Aqua. Yeah, I got I got a gold and a team color match card in like the first two packs. Pretty amazing. Evan Carter. So yeah, I think uh 
you're witnessing firsthand how these, there's a nice Luis Arias, Corbin Carroll, how these uh, retail boxes are the way to go. If you're going to rip Series 1, some people aren't ripping Series 1 at all, which I get. But I feel like most people, myself included, have been ready for some new product for quite some time. And here we go. Bob Feller. Look at that wind up. Leody Tavares on the Aqua. I think the one format I probably won't go for is the Monster Box. It's like 50, 60 bucks. They have like the icy foil cards. There's a Royal Blue Rookie Parallel, Reese Olsen. And Dane Myers, another nice uh, Aqua Rookie Parallel. Need to hit the right names, but no complaining here. We hit the biggest, one of the biggest names there, Jason Dominguez. Looks like we got something in the middle, the backwards card. And nope, it's uh, Ichiro, very cool. Ryan Mountcastle on the Aqua. Jazz Chisholm. A couple packs left. So we'll do, we're going to do four boxes today. And then the next videos will be three and three. So I've got Home Run Challenge there. Soderstrom. And this is going to be Juan Soto donning his old uniform. Nice William Contreras there on the Aqua. Yankees are going to be a force to be reckoned with, that's for sure. I think Judge appreciates the support. So he doesn't have to carry everything anymore. There's Henry Davis. Nice J-Rod. And here we go. So blueprints of Shohei Otani. Very nice. I like these cards, and I don't have one of Shohei. So definitely put that one up on the stand in a moment. And Kyle Finnegan. Riley Green. Let me get my stands ready. And one more box. So yeah, if you haven't bought Series 1 yet, and you were thinking about buying a hobby box, I would most likely steer you away from that, obviously. I mean, I, I, uh, I got some pretty nice cards. This is four boxes. This is going to be, you know, $120 value. Through Fanatics. Nice exclusive box here. And this will be our final rip, uh, blaster to rip in this video. But I mean, in the hobby box, you do get the uh, quote unquote guaranteed hit, usually just some player worn patch. Brian Byron Buxton, Yastrzemski. So, I do like the fact that they took out the, you know, they got like one manufactured patch per blaster last year. And uh, and this year it's all about the parallels. Actually, they did it last year with Sears Update. But there just weren't very many good rookies in that set. There's Raffaella. And here we go, Clayton Kershaw on the blueprints. I'm liking that one. Owen White, rookie on the Aqua, and Mike Trout. Poor Trout. Watani left him. Okay, let's see. But yeah, I mean, these Stars of MLB cards, they, they look nice to me. All right, let's see. Uh, Bruzdar Gratterall. There's a Chrome... Uh, Fernando Tatis Jr. And Royce Lewis on the Aqua. Very cool. Oops. If you want some stars of the MLB cards, let me know. Probably have a couple full sets of those already. It's going to be Lubab. I think so. Yep. How about a redemption? Let's get a redemption this pack. Nope. Jordan Alvarez on the 89 design. 
Raphael Devers on the Aqua. So yeah, I got a lot of a nice stack of Aquas accumulating. Haven't hit any of the big rookie names on one of those Aquas yet, but I think we're due for one. Looks like we've got some backwards fun coming up. It's going to be the Braves on a foil card. Very cool. Surprised they didn't go further this last postseason. And it's going to be Luke Raleigh. Raleigh. On the Aqua. All right. And white. Sal Frelick. Greatest hits. Doesn't have many greatest hits. Just his uh, three. Three hits in his debut. So... Pretty cool. I like those inserts a lot. I think they're really well designed. Look really neat. All right. Three more packs. Let's do it. DeGrom. Trey Cabbage. Mr. Cabbage. What a name. And this is going to be another Jason Dominguez on the green. Man. What a pull. Green Parallel, Jason Dominguez, number to four ninety nine. I guess it's uh, Jason Dominguez Day. Thanks, sir, for paying for my boxes. I wonder what that team color match goes for. I imagine quite a bit. Gabby Moreno. Let's see. There's Miguel Cabrera, Zach Giloff, and Byron Buxton. Last pack of the rip. Let's make it a redemption. All right. Soderstrom, Senga. It's going to be a royal blue. It's going to be our hit. Ellie De La Cruz showing his massive size compared to his little teammate there. All right, and that's going to do it for the rip. I mean, that's just four boxes, and uh, look look how amazing that rip turned out to be. I mean, you're not going to... If you get a team color match, it's probably not going to be one of the best rookies. So, <laughs> But uh, we did it. We hit it. Got um, one, two, three, three numbered cards. Yeah, three number cards. We got several royal blue parallels. Actually, just a few of those. Um, all the aqua parallels, you get one per pack. So you got a good chance of hitting a good name there. We didn't hit um, any big rookie, rookie names for that, but we've got that cool uh, AL leaders there, home runs. Uh, and one gold. And, of course, can't forget our home field advantage card back there, Jordan Alvarez and uh, Blueprints Shohei. So, yeah, definitely much happier with this than if I were to buy another hobby box. Um, that would be my number one recommendation. Um, actually, I don't know if Fanatic still has them in stock, but uh, I would get them if you still could. So, thanks for joining me. If you still are on with me now, you're a champ. See ya.